we are here about justice. We're not here only about prosecution. Queens District Attorney Melinda Katz formed the Conviction Integrity Unit in January of 2020. It is hard to believe that anyone could be so arrogant as to believe that mistakes don't happen in the criminal justice system. People who believe they've been wrongfully convicted can fill out an online application. Katz says every application is reviewed. If they find a case they believe should be re-adjudicated, then the even tougher work begins. But at the end of the day, these are facts that happened 20, 30 years ago. And so they are all in huge boxes, if you have them at all. Um, there has been lost evidence along the way at certain points in Queens. Uh, and so we need to recreate what happened. We vacated since I've been here 71 cases. Many of the wrongfully convicted cases date back to the 80s and 90s. So what's the difference between then and now? Every decade's different. Um, criminal justice shouldn't be that different. Criminal justice should be what's right and wrong. And there is another factor, technology. And that's really what a lot of this is about, is new evidence that's uncovered, new DNA data, new ways of looking at it and, and analyzing it. Katz believes this unit is an integral part of making sure justice is served. The CIU's work has led to several exonerations, including Carlton Roman, Shamel Capers, and the three men wrongfully convicted of killing an off-duty NYPD officer, George Bell, Rohan Bolt, and Gary Johnson. Conviction integrity units are extremely important in today's society. People need to have faith in what we are doing as prosecutors. Ayana Harry, Pix11 News.